the trendy K-pop songs right now. And since it's March and spring is coming, my seasonal allergies have been terrible. But anyways, I'm gonna have this creme brulee from the bakery that I got earlier. I also got this strawberry shortcake. Probably not gonna have it right now. Mmm. I'm gonna be using products from Torden and I also wanted to thank them for sponsoring this video. Torden sent me their products before to just try out and I actually ended up loving the products so I'm so happy to be working with Torden. I also did a giveaway with Torden on my Instagram if you guys remember. Torden Sika line is perfect for sensitive skin as well as calming it. So first I'm gonna use their Balanceful Toner Pads and this is one of my favorite skincare products. These toner pads are formulated to manage all types of skin concerns such as zits or skin texture. I use these almost every day because I love how it feels. As you can see, I already finished one bottle. Next up is the serum. This serum also gives a deep soothing effect to sensitive skin. It has a very nice refreshing formula which feels so moisturizing on my skin. Since my skin gets very dry and sensitive in cold weather, I love using this serum. Next is the cream and it's a very gel type cream formula. It feels so dewy and hydrating on my skin. I just love how it doesn't feel so heavy on my skin after I put it on. Also using Torridin's serum and cream is a perfect combination. Using these two products together really helps with acne prone skin. So that is the end of my skincare routine and look at my skin. The products felt so soothing and calming. So if you're someone with acne or really sensitive skin, make sure to check out Torridin. I will have all the products linked in my description box down below. Hi guys, so it is the next day and it's currently 8.05 a.m. I am running a bit late to my 8.30 a.m. lecture, so I'm just going to eat breakfast in the car. Also, if my voice sounds a bit different and congested, it's because of my seasonal allergies. My nose is literally running right now. just woke up from a nap right after i came back from school i fell asleep because i was so tired i'm gonna have dinner now it is 6 56 p.m
For dinner, I'm having tteokguk, and then this is mushroom chan. Ojunga bokgung. My seasonal allergies are getting so bad that I have to take medication. I blew my nose so much today that it's so red and it's like stinging. <laughs> from school i was at school from like 9 a.m till 5 30 p.m because i had two lectures today but i'm gonna go eat dinner thankfully i don't have to go in person to school tomorrow because i have an oral test online for my korean class my makeup looks so ugly now this is what school air does to you <laughs> For dinner today, I'm having salmon sushi and kungamul meon oden tang. This is a heart cup and it's so cute. I'm just gonna pour this juice box in. The soup is so spicy, so my lips hurt so much right now because I bit them all off. I have a bad habit of biting my lips when I'm like stressed or anxious. Hi guys, so it is the next day. It's currently 12 21 p.m. I've just been studying for my Korean oral test, which is at 2 45 p.m. Last night I fell asleep at 9 p.m. because I was so tired, and then I woke up at around 11 p.m. Brushed my teeth, did my skincare, and went back to bed. And today I woke up at 11 a.m. So I basically had over like 12 hours of sleep. So yeah, that was much needed because I haven't been getting good sleep lately. Anyways, I'm gonna go down and eat something.
For my first meal today, I'm having bungule pasta, but this was my mom's first time making it at home. I had this specific pasta a lot in Korea. And then I also have broccoli soup and salad on the side. For my drink, I'm having pukkari. This cup is so cute. If you watched my Timu haul, you will remember it. I did my hair and makeup earlier after the Korean oral test. I decided to just leave my hair because I have to film this video anyways. It is now 7.52 p.m. and I'm gonna go eat dinner. <laughs> For dinner, I'm having chikseok tteokbokki and corn cheese, also some fried dumplings. Isn't this real kumabo so cute? I got it in Korea, but I forgot about it, so I never used it. Good morning guys, I just woke up like 20 minutes ago. Wait, actually it's not even morning, it's 1.14 p.m. I woke up late today because I don't have school. If you don't know, I crammed all my classes into three days so that I could have a longer weekend. So I only have to go to school from Monday to Wednesday and then starting Thursday, I don't have any lectures. So I'm gonna go eat my breakfast. <laughs> So I'm having koma kimbap and the setting looks so funny. My mom lined it all up in this like long plate. And then I also have keranku. I'm so full now. I literally finished like majority of this, but yeah, that was a really filling meal.
For dinner, I'm having chadarbegi bugunji chobap. I'm just having something light because I'm going out soon with. I've just been editing the whole day today, but I'm actually starving, so I'm gonna go down and eat some dinner. I'm just having this snack before eating because I'm so hungry. This is actually becoming one of my favorite Korean snacks. It's so good. For my dinner, I'm having dampung and this is my mom's first time trying to make homemade dampung We always get this at restaurants, so I'm excited to try I also have bulmandu on the side This literally tastes store-bought, it's so good I'm having seo bukumbap, kungnamulguk, and pechu gotjori, which is basically like kimchi.
10 33 p.m i know i'm having dinner pretty late today i'm just gonna have some natto for dinner i've actually never tried natto but i've always wanted to try it it's always on my tiktok for you page i'm hoping i end up liking it because i know a lot of people don't really like natto when they first try it but i do like soybean paste and like soybean paste foods when it comes to korean food so maybe i will like natto I know people poke a hole and then like remove the wrapper from the bottom, but I think I'm just gonna remove it from the top because I'm lazy to do that. <laughs> or should I just do it the cool way? I'll probably do it the cool way. Whoa. I actually hate mustard, so I don't know if I'm gonna put this in. I don't know why I'm finding this so cool. Do I put the mustard in? I don't know. I really don't like mustard. Let me just taste this like on its own. And if I don't like it, I won't add it. Oh, oh my God. That was way too like strong. I don't know why I'm being so extra. I'm kind of scared to try it. I know people have this with rice. But I'm just going to try it on its own first. definitely not as like strong as i thought it would be because people kept saying it has a really distinct taste but like the texture is kind of weird i heated up some leftover rice in the microwave i don't really like the texture so it is the next day and I just took a shower. Today I woke up at like 9.30 a.m. for my stats quiz, which was just online. But then I went back to sleep after it and now it is 5.54 p.m. Also today was like the daylight saving time change. It would originally only be 4.54 right now. So I'm gonna have my first meal past like 6 p.m. today. So I'm having pineapple pokumbap and my mom put it in like the pineapple itself and it looks really nice. Mmm. I honestly was kind of skeptical of like how it would taste, but it's actually really good. I actually finished all of it. For dinner today, I'm having prunak jongor and my mom made this because my sister just came back from Chicago. So she's having dinner with us too. Mm -hmm. 